The Battery Management System, or BMS, is responsible for monitoring and protecting the battery against any possible failure, balancing the cells to make sure all of them are at the same level of charge, estimating the state of charge and state of health of the battery, and interfacing with the system. MPS offers a wide range of battery monitor and protector ICs and fuel gauge ICs. Customers interested in evaluating our solutions can request our standard BMS reference design board. Prior to customer evaluation for your battery solution, there is some information our MPS engineers must know. First, our engineers will request the cell datasheet, followed by very simple application-related parameters, such as the number of series and parallel cells in the system. MPS will customize and send you a pre-configured board using your battery cell datasheet and the provided application parameters. In the meantime, you can download our GUI from the MPS website to familiarize yourself with our evaluation tools. Once you receive the evaluation board, powering it up is quick and easy. To power up the board for the first time, connect a power supply with a voltage between 20 volt and 70 volt between the VBAT plus and VBAT minus pins. Next, connect the communication interface to the ground, RX, and TX pins of the board, and connect the other end to your computer. Once the board is powered up, open the graphical user interface, or GUI. The easiest way to set up the GUI is by selecting the automatic detection box and the COM port to which the communication interface is connected, then click the launch GUI button. The monitoring tab shows real-time battery measurements, status, and results. For example, you can find the battery's estimated state of charge, state of health, and state of resistance. The GUI also displays other important information, such as power limits as well as remaining runtime and charge time. MPS's GUI also allows the user to record battery tests by simply clicking the record button in the upper left corner. Recording battery tests is very helpful for analyzing performance and results. Once the recording is complete, the GUI exports a CSV file containing all measurements and results, as well as an XML file containing the configured settings. The MPS BMS evaluation board will come pre-configured according to the initially specified parameters. However, you can change these settings in the configuration tab. You can save or load your configuration at any time by clicking the save and load configuration buttons. Note the right configuration button will deploy the GUI settings to the device. Finding the optimal configuration is an iterative task, so we have built in a new feature that we call virtual fuel gauge. The virtual fuel gauge enables re-simulation of recorded tests by loading the test data and using the current configuration to provide updated results. This feature can speed up your evaluation to quickly achieve the optimal configuration for your application. You can also send the exported files to MPS and we will analyze the test data for you. We can also suggest configuration settings that improve results and provide support as needed. To learn more, visit monolithicpower.com. Like this video and subscribe to our channel to get the latest on our innovative new products.